Here's my five-step program to become an alpha. Step one. Sleep three seconds a year. Sleep is for the weak! Step two. Stop wiping your ass. You're wasting time. Get in the gym! Step three. Rip off your toenails and put them in your fucking cereal. It's protein! Step four! Take showers in a fucking volcano. Become numb to the pain. Step five. Eat your car! Ride a fucking bull to the gym! Yeah, motherfucker! Here's three things you should never say to a bad boy. Number one. Make me. Nobody tells daddy what to do. Now get your fucking ass over here. Number two. <laughs> never say my name in public. You can call me daddy, master, or savage. <laughs> Number three... Can we listen to Frank Ocean? <laughs> what the fuck? Do you wanna fucking die? Excuse me. <laughs> Does anybody know what time it is? Um, by the looks of it, it says it's approximately... Demon time. <laughs> right, um... Does anybody else actually know the time? I said... It's... Yo, DJ T Rec, run the beat. You're out in public and your ass itches. What the fuck do you do? Well, here's three simple secretive techniques to scratch that ass. Twerk on a stranger. This is good for both parties because one, you get rid of your itch, and two, who doesn't love a little twerk sesh? Body addy ass. Where's my wallet? This technique, you're gonna wanna act like you don't know where your wallet is. And as soon as you reach into your back pocket, yahoo! The banana butt peel. This technique kills two birds with one stone. One, you get that nasty itch out, and two, you have a delicious snack after. Get you a man that could tap into his femininity and his masculinity, like me. <laughs> Mom, I wanna play with Barbies and I love the color pink! <laughs> Fuck! So that was actually the feminine side, if you couldn't tell. Here's the masculine. Where the fuck is my Mountain Dew? You need to leave. I'm starting to see red. Oh no! He's coming! My inner demon! Where the fuck is a Mountain Dew? So yeah, get you a man that can do both. This is for everybody that keeps on asking what it'd be like if I was a gecko. And yes, I do get that question a lot, so... I'd probably crawl on the ground super fast, <laughs> like a little zilly goose. Oh, and I'd eat so many much yogurts because I love yogurt. Oh, and I'd probably be a famous gecko dancer, as you can see here. So... Get ready with me to go hang out with Playboy Cardi. <laughs> got the leather pants from Rick Owens. We got the chrome belt, chrome hearts, real chrome hearts. And then we got the black tank from Rick Owens as well. For the bunions, we're gonna put on these cowboy boots straight from Opium Farms. Now this next piece is a really special piece of mine. It's a collab I did with Rick Owens on a bodyless hoodie. I know it looks fucking tough. I've been doing shit like this. Now this fit is crazy. Me against the world, because it's the world against me. Since this is a little calm opium fit, I went light on the accessory today. We got Balenci glasses. We got the tie on the brim. And then we got the apple pods around the neck. Fuck with them. Opium lords, do you approve of this fit? Opium, 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 opium. It's a little 360 of this little calm opium ad fit. Yeah, I gotta bounce because Cardi's waiting on me. <laughs> opium, out. <Beep>. Mother, <laughs> I found the last golden ticket. <laughs> Get up and dance, we made it. We're rich, we're no longer poor. We're no longer poor, mother.
absolutely wonka for that wedding. <laughs> I'm absolutely wonka for that fucking wedding. Give me that Wonka chocolate bar. Give me that Wonka <coughs> chocolate bar. It's a chocolate bar that I want from the Wonka. I want the Oompa Loompa with the fucking chocolate. Chocolate bar with the Oompa Loompa. POV, you wake me up from nap time. Kitten, is that you? <laughs> Daddy misses your cuddles. I want your kisses and hugs and so much love. <laughs> Come here, kitten. I miss you. I'm sorry, but if your mans don't wake you up like this. Good morning, my little pookie peanut butter pumpkin puff. I've been watching you for the last three hours, and did you know you snore as loud as a beluga whale? Like a fat fucking beluga whale. <laughs> God, you're so fat. Oh, why are your armpits wet? Sawi, Papa got hungry. <laughs> you don't mind though, do you? They taste like pistachios. <laughs> oh, where'd your toenails go? <laughs> like I said, Papa got hungry. <laughs> well, now you know who does. <laughs> Here are three effective ways to stand up to a bully. Number one. Tell the teacher. Miss teacher, miss teacher, he's bullying me. He's bullying me. Bully alert, bully alert. Please get him in trouble. Please call the principal, please. Number two, call the cops. Awesome, I'll see you then. Yeah, that was the cops. They said they're gonna bring the canine unit and you both are going to prison and you're gonna serve a minimum of 135 years in prison. Cool. Number three, start growling. <laughs> Surprisingly, that one's the most effective. Acting challenge, you're the blue line. Hello there, my fair maiden. <laughs> Would you be so kind to accompany me to the dance floor? <laughs> oh, aren't you a little bad girl ting, huh? <laughs> Listen here, baby girl. Papa doesn't ask twice. So put on your fucking chanclas and let's get jiggy! DJ d -Rec, run the beat. Papa, I said I want an entire state of New York City, not a Excuse me, sir. Hey, Elon, I don't have to call you back. There's a peasant on my window. Excuse me, you're actually... Halt. I get it. You see the wealth, the popped collar, the bust down rolling on the wrist. Wanna look at me, what do you see? Asshole. Sugar daddy. Now, you're here for one of two reasons. One, you want to be my sugar mama. Ow! Or two, you want a little bit of sugar from sugar papa daddy. <laughs> um... Lucky for you, I'm partnering with Cash App to give away money. How old are you again? I'm 20. 85? Damn, those wrinkles are thick. <laughs> All good, though, because the app's now available for ages 13 and above. I don't need your money. Oh, really? That outfit says differently. <laughs> Listen, you're in my car. Get the hell out. Right. Your car. Look, Papa's in a tough spot. He's got bills on top of Then bills. maybe Papa should put his cash tag down below for a chance to <sighs> win. Because it seems like you really need it. Okay, just know karma's real. You tried to steal my car. The door was unlocked. Get ready with me to go to my grandma's funeral. You're telling me grandma didn't hang around at any baddies. That's unfortunate. Should I even pull up? Right, so the vibe for today is definitely dark, depressed, and super fucking sad. Yeah, let's get right into it. Starting down at the pants, we got these Fire Y Project denim jeans. Creme de la creme. Ay, what? I'm just gonna pair this with like a black button up. Bitch, call me Houdini. Ay, okay. Hit him with the shimmy. Hit him with the shimmy. I did just get my first chest hair, so we're gonna be showing that off today. We're gonna run these shit kickers. Would you look at that? Now we're getting somewhere, huh? You can't forget the diamonds. Yo, Vogue, GQ, ring my line. <laughs> what? Reverse? But yeah, that's a fit. Let me know what you guys think, and um, RIP Graham. <laughs> Figured out how to create world peace. Gotta get up and dance every once in a while. Dance like nobody's watching. Hey, y'all. Yeah. Don't forget to sing. Sing your little heart out, songbird. I hate you, I love you. I hate that, I love you. Love that song.
Exhale all that negative energy and breathe in the positive vibes. Come on, let's all go outside. Let's hold hands and sing and dance until the sun comes out. The sun will come out tomorrow. Dance with me. Don't you feel better already? Get rid of that hatred and bring in all that positive energy. I want to go outside and feel like I'm in a musical. Don't you? We all could go outside and sing and dance. I bet you the sun would come out one last time. Dear Santa Claus, I know I'm on the naughty list this year, but I made a song for you, so hopefully I can get on the good list. Who knows? It's worth a shot, right? One, two. One, two, three, four. Four little elves knocking on my door. Talking about the big man from the North Pole. I said, Yo, Pierre, you want to come out here? want to talk about no St. Nicholas? Oh, this ain't no holly jolly Christmas when you coming from the trenches. Oh, you eating buttermilk biscuits while I'm sipping on milk and eating Triscuits. You want to know what's on my wish list? A bag full of riches. I'm talking monies and diamonds and bad bitches. I can't say that word anymore, unfortunately. My parents got mad last time and I got grounded and I couldn't play Fortnite for a whole week. That was terrible. And I'll never do that again. So yeah, I can't I can't say that word. But yo, that was good, right? Get ready with me to go alligator wrestling. I know what you're thinking, Peyton, you're way too weak to be alligator wrestling. Think again. Hey. We're gonna start off with these black pleated trousers from cost these are women's but it doesn't matter because i'm snatched and you bitches are mad <laughs> you're mad no you're really mad thank you uh, 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 uh. although real quick let me do my dance she said, Bam, I'm nasty, I think me too. keep the black tank but we're also going to put on this gray leather jacket from all saints yeah, god damn hey watch this shit though One of our gators has a brother that passed away. R.I.P. Rango, you will be truly missed. But I did something special for him. I decided to make a pair of shoes out of his brother. So hopefully he'll enjoy that today. Woo -hoo -hoo. What? I said I'm crop walking. What? What? I said I'm crop walking. I can't forget the diamonds. Hi. <laughs> I, I, I be popping bottles. Sparkles and champagne. Mm. Yeah, that's the fit. Let me know if you guys like it. And yeah, I gotta bounce because I gotta catch some gators. <laughs> to the swamp we go, bitch. Thank you. Get ready with me to rob a bank. <laughs> hey, Peyton, why are you gonna do that? That's not nice. You double bubble gum dumb mother. You just don't get it. I'm bad to the bone, bitch. Yeah, let's get right into the video. We're gonna start off with these black denim Y Project jeans. Back pocket looking extra scrum diddly umptious. I know you wanna take a bite because you're a hungry motherfucker. It's that 24 karat magic. Hey, do the stanky leg. Do the stanky leg. Why is it so stanky in here? Gray hoodie to match the tank. Don't ask me where this is from because I ain't gonna tell you because I'm a gatekeeper, bitch. Y'all are not ready for this shit right here. I'm gonna do my little gansy dance. I'm gonna do my little gansy dance. Stussy denim jacket. Stussy McStuckinson. Stunson style. Uh, and action. Hey. Too cold, too fresh, too clean. Bitch, you wish you were me. Hi, am I so precious? The fuck? And to finish this fit off, we're gonna pair these with some black Doc Martens. And yes, this is a piece of gum stuck in my shoe waist. Walk a mile in my shoes. Maybe the shoes that you walk in? <laughs> Can't get these at Foot Locker, bitch. Hey! God, I'm too good! Nobody does it like me! So yeah, that's the fit. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Got a blast! Hey, yo, shorty. You trying to get freaky? Boy, you are not a freak. Oh, I'm a freak. I'm the freak of the week. I'm the freakiest! Uh, okay. <laughs> Suck my toes, then. Oh. Sorry, what? Suck oh. the fungus out my no. motherfucking toenail, bitch. <laughs> bitch! Are you part of a lost raptor? Because them shits look dangerous. Oh, so you ain't gonna suck my toes, huh? Nah. Those aren't toes, bitch. Those are fucking talents. 
I didn't know you was a dinosaur, so Get I'm not over here. Damn. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Face ID, bitch. Who the fuck are you? I'm the owner of this phone. It's me. Do you think I'm blind? I do this shit for a living. Now, I don't know what fucking dumpster you just rolled out of, but you need to give me back to my owner before I call my bad girl Siri and we get shit popping. No, it's me. Look at my look at my fucking forehead. See how big that shit is? Oh, it is you. Ain't nobody got a forehead that fucking big. I don't have any ass left to give to the next generation, man. My daughter finna just have a crack. She finna be shitting out printer paper. Eight by 12 sheets. Hey girl, shake what your daddy gave you. Absolutely fucking nothing. Body, yaddy, 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 yaddy. So the other day, somebody must have recognized me while I was walking home. And if you ever wanted to know what fucking Bigfoot looked like, bitch. Like, huh? Who let this wildebeest out? My neck is so flat, I can eat a full course meal off the back of that shit. God damn. Y'all seeing this? L look at my neck. Who you know with an acute angle neck? Bitch, why the fuck is my chin touching my chest? Hey, do you wanna see how strong I am? Um, no, not really. I don't really care. Are you sure? Cause my dad said my muscles are as big as a mountain. All right, let's see how strong you are then. Aren't they freaking big? Wow, you're so strong! Thanks, I already knew that. Your forehead's kind of big, and your teeth are crooked. Bye. Guys, here are some of my favorite animal crossbreeds on the entire planet. Bear Shark, aka Bark! This is a motherfucking Elephorilla. Is that a Loch Ness Monster? No, bitch, that's a giraffe. This a motherfucking Barboon, bitch! Look at this cute-ass cat million, cuz! Be honest with you, I don't know what the fuck this shit is, but this bitch go whore! There, girl. Are you recording? Yes. Guys, this is my pet cucumber. His name's Gerald. We're like the best friends in the whole universe, Galaxy. Sometimes we go on runs. Look how fast Gerald is. Come on, Gerald. You're so fast. Sometimes you swing in circles together. You're so cute, Gerald. Basically, what I'm trying to say is get you a friend like Gerald. Go on, Gerald. We've got some fun together. Here are some of my favorite animal crossbreeds on the entire planet. This is a motherfucking zebrilla. A platypus eye I spy with my little eye. Aww, look how cute this kangaroo fin is. This is a beeline boon eye. I just want to kick the fuck out of it. Oh, it's a piggy cat. Sorry, what? <laughs> My bad, I just lose my breath when I'm around you. <laughs> <laughs> Quick question, Mamas, you got a boyfriend? No, and I don't want one. Shit, I don't want to be your boyfriend either. <laughs> I'm trying to be your husband. I'm trying to take you to places you ain't never been before. Oh. I can show you the world. I can take you to a five-star restaurant. Oh, really? Mm. Which one? It's this place in France called, um, how do you say, a McDonald's. Where'd you go? Up here, princess. Look, I'm doing a lot of this. Let's start doing a little bit of this. You have cash app? No. Shit. Get your money up, not your funny up. The app's now available for ages 13 and up. I sent you a little present. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Did you just send me a dollar? Hey, don't spend it all at once. Put it towards your college tuition. Maybe buy a car. I don't know. <laughs> See you, I used to rip straight bombs in class, some fat, juicy-ass farts, cuz, but I'd never get caught, cuz I used to beatbox over them bitches so nobody would know. Don't never fucking know. Don't never know. Good morning, my beautiful fucking girlfriend that's so loyal and would never cheat on me because she loves me so much. <laughs> oh, look, it must be fucking opposite day. Do you have a little secret you want to tell Papa? A little dirty little fucking secret? Maybe that you kissing Brian under the fucking tree last night? Fuck! You don't know how that makes me feel? How that hurts my heart? I put together a little piece for you. It goes like this. One, two, one, two, three. There's a fire starting in my heart. Things laying on my own, my own, my own, my own the dark. Bet you didn't know I could sing, huh? Well, 
there's a lot of things you don't know about a person when you time it, when the thing when you can't even when <laughs> Hey, can I have one of those blueberries or blueberries? <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> four times, approximately five if you count the Merriam-Webster version. And I've yet to come across the word boobleries. Would you like to enlighten me on what exactly that word means? Crickets. As per usual. Gosh, you're a mouth breather. And your brain's probably soup. Nobody's gonna love you, and that's the reason why your girlfriend left you. So. Boobleries. Fucking idiot. Fucking idiot. Valentine's Day is right around the corner, and for the 22nd year in a row, I will be spending it alone. <laughs> What's new? Literally, here are three reasons why I should be a Valentine. I literally have a $5 gift card to Wiener Central. By the way, so I could probably get you like four corn dogs. By the way, number two. Unfortunately, I don't have an automated vehicle because I don't, because it could get, because it could, because it care about the planet. So my mama said she would drive us to Wiener Central. Either that or you can ride on the back of my Blazer scooter. By the way, last but not least, of course, I can tap dance. By the way. Hey, Baka, why don't you tell the people what happens when Senpai gets angry? You don't want to mess with this guy when he's angry. Yeah. He is a yellow belt in karate. Yeah, actually, I've hurt so many much people that there's a lot of people that I've hurt. So, <laughs> Show them what you're made of, Senpai. <laughs> Nunchucks! Ow! I'm so sorry, my little Baka. Please forgive Papa Senpai. Here are some of my favorite fake laughs that I use every day because you bitches aren't funny. Number one. <laughs> That's hilarious. Number two. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> Number four. <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> Number five. <laughs> Optimus Prime. Um, if you can take me to work, my car broke down again. If it isn't the consequences of our there own actions. Oh, dude. Every time it's a life lesson. Look, it's a simple yes or no. Yes or no. Life dude. is not simple. Each choice we make leads us down a different path. You thought you ate, huh? Mm -mm. No. Uh, look, the only path I need to take is the path to work so I can make money, <laughs> so I can afford your car bill. So you don't get towed. Please help me. Fine. Only if you give me a wash done. when you get <laughs> home. Consider it done. You're my boy. I got you. I promise. Shake on it. Whoa. I'm going to meet you outside. Wait. Wait, can you do the thing before we go? Autobots roll out. Yes, dude. That's so sick. I call shotgun. Not even close. You're sitting in the back. Again, dude. Okay, don't mind my sister's face. She got burnt to the fucking bone. We can't tell which one's a better singer, so she goes first, and then I have to follow, and you guys decide who's better. Go first. Sometime this year. <laughs> now I will go. <laughs> Last one to settle the score. <laughs> Come on, fuck! Go! <laughs> Cause all the cool kids, they seem to fit in. I think you got something stuck in your throat. <laughs> all the cool kids, they seem to fit in. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Holy shit, y'all don't stand a fucking chance. When I'm with you, I don't wanna be with Quick question, love. Do you want to get filthy? Yes. Or do you want to get nasty? Right. Do you want to get filthy? Or do you want to get bloody nasty? <laughs> what?
Did you say nasty? <laughs> Why'd you say that? Uh, wrong answer. You bore me. <laughs> You're boring. <laughs> Fucking boring. News fast. Oh no, she's crying. <laughs> like I said, babe, you're boring and you couldn't handle all this. It's best if you run along with the rats. Because <laughs> that's what you are. A little boring fucking rat. <laughs> what does that mean? I couldn't tell you because I'm not a fucking rat. Scrum! Maybe this guy isn't so bad after all. <laughs> I'm just going to be a cute old man when I... Oh, how sweet are you wanna give Grandpa a hug? Mm. No. <laughs> I ate y'all up in this universe and I'm gonna eat y'all up in the next. <laughs> Behold, the Peyton verse. <laughs> it's an absolute fucking unit. He had to have been crafted by the gods. It doesn't get better than this. <laughs> mm, I lied. <laughs> Do I even need to say anything? No, seriously, does anything need to come out of my mouth for it to wrap around your small peanut brain that I'm that motherfuck? Literally so precious. <laughs> it's so fluffy, I wanna die! I think this morning had to have malfunctioned, so. Yep, 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 yep. Gilf. Gilf! Emphasis on the ilf! Look, I don't know if you can handle all that. <laughs> You might fuck around and get your heart broken. Real shit. Look at him. You think he cares? He don't give a fuck! Here are three simple riz techniques for my single queens and kings. Number one, the subtle riz. Number two, the seductive riz. Number three, Demon Time Riz. Here are some of my favorite animal crossbreeds on the entire planet. Ah! This is a hawk -oceros. That's a Billy Butter Goat, bitch. Aw, uh, it's a doll frog. That is a Hippodilopotamus. Cleo, it's a fucking kangaroo. Fellas, how are you gonna go to the gym and not hit legs? Not do a single squat or a fucking jumpy jack. I don't you walking around 90% upper body, 10% leg. Bitch, you built like a fucking ice cream cone. One razor scooter to the shin, your ass finna shatter into a million pieces. Bitch, you built like Mr. Krabs. Ain't nobody fucking with you. Over here walking like. Oh my god, are you Peyton King? <laughs> no! You can call me daddy. <laughs> hey, daddy. Mmm, good girl. What's your name? Janet. Mm, no, that's too fucking ugly. Do you mind if I call you Pumpkin Munchkin? <laughs> uh, cool. I have a present for you. Do you want to see it? Mm. Hey! Hey! So, what'd you think? I ain't gonna lie to you, that was ugly as hell, boy. Don't do that shit again, bro. Would you want to take a ride on the back of my bike with me, please? No, that thing's really ugly. Kind of like you. Yeah, what a loser. Wait. Whoa. Are you? Batman. Yeah. Nice bike. Fast bike, actually. It's broken the sound barrier a couple times. I think I'm getting a phone call, actually. Hello. You want me to save the city of Gotham? <laughs> awesome. Um, can I get a ride, maybe? <laughs> You ain't really fuck with me way back then, but how about now? Cause you suck right now. And I'm up right now. No, you can't. Yeah, duty calls. Can I get your number at least? No. You always were a good girl, but your best in the likes that work for out. Then one day you kissed me. And I realize what everybody's talking about Yeah, you need to see the fucking dentist Because your breath smells like Brussels sprouts And I know you weren't perfect To be honest, you weren't even fucking close 
That doesn't mean I didn't love you with all my heart and all of my bones. So come home to Papa's and let Daddy rub your feet. Cause I'll love you forever, even though your breath smells like beer. Oh, oh, oh. What was that? Don't be frightened, little creature. Hello, it's me. Are you a werewolf? No, I'm not a werewolf. I'm a warrior, and this is my home. Okay, cool. No, I'm wait, just hold gonna... on. I have a present for you. I don't want a present. Go, Cougars! What was that? You'll find out really shortly in, in like a short <laughs> amount of time. So. Okay. sister that I love so much. How was your Thanksgiving? It was good. <laughs> was it? Um, mine was a fucking disaster. <laughs> because here's the thing. When I was out there, I was looking for the pumpkin pie. And remember when I told you that I wanted a slice? Yeah. There's not a single fucking <laughs> crumb left. <laughs> so either you... <laughs> so either you had the last slice of pie, or the fucking pumpkin man had it. And by the smell of your breath, it was fucking you, you little fucking dirty little fucking rat! <laughs> if you even come close to the fucking mashed potatoes, your ass is grassing on the fucking lawnmower. <laughs> oh, and you're adopted. Fuck you. <laughs> rat. Hey, citizens of the internet. I'm a barter. And today I'm gonna try and trade this pineapple for this $500,000 million house. Knock, knock. Pineapple knock. <laughs> Classic. Hey, pineapple guy, uh, can I trade you my $500,000 million house for that pineapple? I don't care. Okay, cool, here's the keys, honey, let's go. Pleasure doing business with you, sir. I'll let you know if I have any more pineapples. And just like that, I sold a stupid fucking pineapple for a $500,000 million house. What the fuck are you doing with your life? Get off your ass! Today we're playing Incoherent. With Hillbilly Buck. <laughs> you! Ingo. Pull... Politically incorrect. Politically incorrect. <laughs> Politically incorrect. <laughs> Second try. Come on. How moon dumb elk? How how moon dumb elk? Dumb elk. How moon dumb elk? How moon? I'm a milk. <laughs> Last try. Come on. Cosmo, pull it in. Cosmo. Oh, bitch, I know this from the heart. I can feel it in my bones. I know this, motherfucker. Cosmo, put in. I mean, Cosmo. <laughs> I mean. So I'm really about to drive myself to Barnes and Nobles and buy myself a dictionary. Why? Because I'm in here on quarantine playing Scrabble with my six-year-old cousin, and she's over here spelling words like catastrophe, soliloquy, illuminescence. And I'm over here trying to figure out where the fuck the I goes in there. She's saying some shit like E before I except after Y. Where the fuck's the Y? What? Why? Am I missing something? I don't even know if this is the right word to use, but I am furiated. Furiated. E before I, except after Y. Shut the f Them, is your summer body ready? Me. <laughs> Triple facts. <laughs> the love I give other people, the love I receive. <laughs> That's so facts, yes. <laughs> no cap. Nobody loves me. <laughs> Serious situation? My brain. <laughs> How lonely are you? Me. <laughs> That's so facts. I don't have any friends. <laughs> Somebody be my friend, please. I was singing oh, when. Hey, hey. Could you, like, shut the fuck up? Because you're, like, really bad at singing. <laughs> Look, little lady, you must have lost something. And that something is probably magic. So here it goes. One, two, one, two, three. I've got the magic in me. Yeah. Ow! Every time I <laughs> touch that track, it turns into <laughs> what does it turn into? Gold. Ah, <sighs> so. Just remember that there's always gonna be something out there for you and if it's and so. I gotta go. Okay. This is the fastest cashier I know. Oh, and he gets down. Fast. He it's don't play. Socks.
balls of energy. It's spiritual. Stephanie's sipping on a glass of iced Earl Grey hibiscus nutmeg sulfur dioxide tea, my favorite. <laughs> As you can see, my skin is glowing. And a lot of you have asked, Stephanie, did you get work done? <laughs> you silly motherfucker! No! Sorry, my chakras weren't aligned. I'm all better now. No, I did not get work done. The reason why my skin looks like porcelain and you couldn't find a wrinkle if you put it under a fucking microscope is because I know none of you bitches can compare. Right. And the reason why you look like a fucking raisin is because you're an insecure, jealous, hating, rotten motherfucker. Damn! What the fuck are you looking for? Can't find my fucking wallet, bro. I've been looking for the last two days. Two days? Damn. My bitch, I, I Yo. look everywhere. Just check the last place you lost it. Oh, my mama, that bitch gonna be right there. What? The fuck did you just say? Just look in the last place you lost no. it. No! Give me your fucking forehead! Pick one! Either have a fat ass forehead or be dumb as fuck. You can't have both. I'm just trying to help. Aww! Can I get a little kissy kissy on my lippy lippy? Rats! Why not, you little fucking bitch? Who cares if I'm a crusty dusty old man? I heard that I have the wettest, slimiest, creamiest kisses in the whole wide world. So what do you say? Pucker up for Uncle Freddy, because I'm going to steal a kiss whether you like it or not. Hey, sir, do you work here? Sure do. Damn, you are thick, boy. I know. How may I assist you? I was wondering, how many dollars is it for this show? Those bad boys are gonna be thirty dollars. Ah, uh, rats! I only have fifty cents in the Starbucks drink. I'm sure, we can work something out. <laughs> Here goes well, my shit. shit! Oh my god, he's throwing it back! God damn, you caked up! Cool, huh? Yeah, that is so cool. Fucking trip, how it's doing that, just jumping around and shit. It's got like a mind of its own. I just. I have no clue where I was going with this video, so. Hi, welcome to Chipotle. What can I get started for? Awesome! Thanks for having me. It's an honor to be here. Can I get your polo burrito with lettuce, tomato, and can I get extra sour cream? Awesome! Oh, um, I don't know if you heard me or not, but I actually said extra sour cream, so can I just get a little bit more, please? Yeah, just a little bit more. A little bit more? No, just a little bit more. A little bit more. Just a little bit more. A little bit more, please? A little bit more? A little bit more? A little bit more? Perfect. Oh, and before you wrap it up, can you just dunk the whole thing in a tub of sour cream as well? Perfect. Nope, that should be it. Oh, wait, can I just get a couple sides of sour cream, too? Sweet, you're the best. <laughs> I love your points. Bitch, put down the coffee. Drink a glass of water once a month because your skin's starting to look crispy as fuck. Ooh, a senior in high school over here looking like a senior citizen. Make it make sense. Like, why your knees buckling, bitch? Don't leave me now. Whoa, damn. Oh, hey, hold on. Also, I just know your pee thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. Like, you practically pissing out mustard, huh? Yeah. That's not normal. Hey! <gasps> what? Shit, sorry. My bad. What? Hi. <laughs> You're so ugly! Don't you think I know, Dad? I'm a failure. I'm the scum of the earth! But at least I can fucking doggy! Yeah. <laughs> oh, you yeah. wouldn't dare! Aww. I think it's doggy time. Tornado flew over him. I've ruined these. Here we go. You hear the news? No. Frank dropped the album? Oh, no, bitch. Michael Jackson has risen from the dead and is dropping Thriller Part 2 later this week. Can I be honest with you, man to man? I don't give a fuck about no Michael Jackson, bitch. I want my Frank Ocean album. That's it. Whoopsie. I think I forgot to mention that scientists have discovered fire breathing dragons off the coast of Brazil. Don't give a fuck about no fire breathing dragon, bitch. I'm gonna beat his ass. Breaking news Uncle. a meteor the size of the sun is expected to crash into Earth within 24 hours. Oh no, we should have died. Hey, but where the Frank now Ocean the album at, dog? We gonna get a release date. 
I don't care. I don't care. Ask me if I care. I don't care. Listening to you speak today has brought me more pain than when I gave birth to triplets in a McDonald's drive through on the back of a fucking motorcycle. You talking makes me physically fucking ill. Say one more word and I promise you, I will projectile vomit my zucchini bread all over your fat fucking face. So sit the fuck down and shut the fuck up for the rest of the semester. Fuck. Dear Santa Claus, I've written you five letters and I've yet to get a response. I don't know what you could be doing over there at the North Pole that's so fucking important. I don't know if you eat gingerbread cookies and eggnog all day, you fat mother- Sorry, I got carried away. But if I don't wake up to a big booty Latina under my Christmas tree... <laughs> no! Krampus is coming out the motherfucking woodworks. Me, the Grinch, Scrooge, gonna fuck some shit up. Excuse me, what the fuck did you just say? No, this is not Dr. Seuss, you fucking mouth breather. This is the finest piece of literature known to man. <laughs> Shakespeare? Okay, look. Before you fucking come interrupt me while I'm reading and I'm diving into a whole nother realm of fucking literature, <laughs> think! Use that big fucking noggin! That big fucking cranium, you fucking mega mind! Knock knock, oh yeah, it's pretty fucking hollow. Who could tell? Who could guess? Me! Because I, because I read books, because I'm smart. <sighs> Oh my gosh, I love Minecraft and the things. Did you just say you like Minecraft? Yeah, I said that. Well, I like Fortnite. Stop saying that. I said it once. Just stop saying that before I barf in your mouth. Just do it, I don't even care. What? Just barf in my mouth, I'm hungry. Okay, I'm sorry. Mmm, <laughs> tastes like carrots. Maybe Minecraft isn't so bad after all. <laughs> Hi, Papa. I've missed you. You crashed my fucking car! Papa, I see your anger levels are rising. I'm going to sing for you to make it feel better. Don't you love, fucking love, 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 Sleep tight, Papa. Sister, why is your holy jolly spirit so low this year? Because I didn't get the Christmas presents I wanted. Damn it, you <laughs> said! I literally told Santa to bring you your gifts. You know what? I actually have an extra gift for you. Would you like to see it? Yeah. Chapstick for your dry fucking lips. That's for Thanksgiving, bitch. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Take some booty flakes on the way out. I literally don't want to see you on fucking Easter. If you pull up on Easter, me and the- Oh, dude, I fucking- This is the try not to fall in love with me challenge. I'm gonna stop the video when I think you fell in love. <laughs> Should be quick, so. Oh. Action. Good girl. <laughs> what was that? You can't hear me? Let me get a little closer. Good girl. Still didn't hear me? Awesome. Let me get a little closer for you. Good girl. I killed that shit. You know what I'm saying? So when's the wedding? <laughs> uh. This is for everybody that keeps on asking me what it'd be like if I was a cat. And yes, I do get that question a lot. Probably be pretty fast, as you can see here. And I'll probably always be telling jokes and stuff. Meow. <laughs> and last but not least, I'm a lover. But you mess with my family, and I'm a monster. Oh my gosh! You wanna know what smells better than Mama's meatloaf? Not my crusty toenails, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Um, a fresh can of tennis balls. Let's take a lift. So I accidentally just opened it off camera and all of the smell went in my car and I'm only gonna cry? <laughs> this goes out to all the single ladies out there. If you single and you ready to mingle, raise your hands. <laughs> you lonely fuck. Maybe if you took a fucking shower or decided to brush your teeth for once. Your breath wouldn't taste like cauliflower And your armpits wouldn't smell like skunk Because you're stinky, 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 so stinky, yeah This is for all the haters that don't believe my biological father is Pitbull, Mr. Worldwide 
Mr. Worldwide, Dolly Dolly. I like boots, beamers, and big bumblebees. I'm tired of these broke ass bitches always trying to humble me. Like, sit down, relax, shut your trap, your fit is whack. Also, your tongue is as brown as my butt crack, bitch. You need a tic tac. Ooh. You know, I was just pondering, as I usually do in the later hours of the evening. And if I could describe myself in three words, it would be smooth like butter. Hey, sweet like honey. <laughs> And wet like water. <laughs> hey, don't get too close. You might fuck around and drown off this wave. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Not friendly. Not friendly. Put that little mutt on a leash before he turns into chopped liver. Hey, settle down, boy. Be good. I'm serious. If that rat gets any closer, he gonna get got. You gonna leave with no dogs and a pocket full of fur. Oh, shit. You gotta go buck wild. Look at him. He on his hind legs. He about to pounce. I'm serious, lady. Get that thing under control before all hell breaks loose. Come on, boy. You ain't gotta do it to him. Don't do it to him. Oh, fuck. He already made up his mind. Get over here. Oh, get over here. Yo, Sway! Hype House! Look, I love these unseasoned, flavorless, cement block tasting, whoa, hitting dice roll, having dances y'all creating, but if you don't start adding a. Hey! Vert, 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 verse on your bitch ass! Well, then, I guess your lights aren't gonna be the only thing that gets knocked out. Sorry. You thought I was feeling you? <laughs> I was. I actually really liked you a lot. Like, with all of my heart and bones. I thought you were the most prettiest person in the entire universe galaxy. Yeah. I'm a nice guy. I'm not a munch. Seriously. I promise. So this man came up to me today and said, Boy, you is so scrumptiously umptious. You built like a bottle of honey and I just want to drizzle you over some graham crackers. Okay. First and foremost, you a bottle of 2% milk because that shit was smooth as fuck. Second and second most, I'm calling Child Protective Services because you was 87 years old and I've never felt more uncomfortable in my life. Yo, babe, it's the smelly armpits for me. Woo! Stinky. Garlic. It's constantly reading Brent Rivera fan fiction for me. Shh! Tell us a secret. You're not supposed to tell anybody I'm that. Sorry. Okay. We've just been prioritizing Brent Rivera over our relationship. Okay, but he's a TikToker and you're not. He's know, funny and like you're not. Really he's better weird. at things that you aren't. Really you're weird. not cute. He is. <laughs> mm, got that sharp ass jawline. Got that crew neck. Got that polo. Got that drippy drip. And I got myself a fresh ass little huddy haircut. Plus the sun got me looking like a bottle of honey. So who trying to go 50-50 on some kids, cuz? Why is it that people with no lips be talking the most shit? <laughs> That's like a fish. Trying to run a marathon. Mm, I'm sorry. <laughs> you ain't built for that big man. Your lips disappear when you smile like this. <laughs> you need a limit on how many fucking words you can say in a day. Because them bitches putting in overtime. Like, she doesn't even fucking have a personality. That's, <laughs> I don't know why anybody would like her. You don't have any fucking lips. Shut the fuck up. Imagine being that bitch that can't even smile because their teeth are just engulfed in a sea of gums. <laughs> Could it be me? Okay, back straight, chin up, and give me a big old smile. Jeez. Damn! Yo, gummy, gummy. Those Jeez. gums on swole mode. Gummy boy! Head up! Ooh, that's that motherfucker 25 cent. My big dog 50 cent. And my main man 100 cent. Yo, where the fuck is 75 cent at? Right here, silly goose. Shabam! Kapow! And a twirl for the girls. And maybe a couple punches. What the fuck? Tell me my shit ain't receding. <gasps> Are you dead ass? When the fuck did my forehead get so big? Oh my god, I look like that bitch from Jimmy Neutron. Yeah, damn! We got the same fucking forehead. The shadows are consuming my soul. Life is a disease, and you will all feel my wrath soon. Hon, all I said was tie your shoes. Okay, but I don't know how to tie my shoes, Mom!
I literally told you to get the ones with the Velcro straps. Seriously, can you not listen? Is somebody sad their boyfriend cheated on them? <laughs> well, you should have saw it coming when you found out he used his Axe Body Wash 6 in 1! That boy don't give a fuck! He over here using this shit to brush his teeth and wash his car! He don't care about you! He don't even care about himself! I'm gonna be honest, I'm built like a neck pillow. My back ain't been the same since high school. Like, bitch. The way I would push off this desk into this chair and feel every bone in my vertebrae just snap, crackle, pop back into place was the most exuberating experience of my life. I mean, my nickname in high school was Bubble Red Beck. Over here sounding like... In the back of the classroom. Had me walking into class 511 and leaving 6-6. Six, six. So if anybody knows where I can cop one, just let me know. Somebody came up to me and asked me, Hey, are you Usain Bolt? No, sweetheart. Only on the weekends. Got a blast. Let me tell you something. Your wife loves me. The government hates me. And fish are afraid of me. Yay! Yeah, yeah. If you're having a bad day, just remember you could have been born a British person. Don't get me wrong, I love British people. You know, Lingadium Leviosa. Like that wizard shit's lit, but like this easily could have been you. Easily. So be grateful. Now imagine if this was your firstborn. Mental in it. I'm 99% sure that all babies look like this over there. But hey, at least they got good food, right? Yeah, I'll take the beans and toast, please. Oh, you didn't hear me. I said I'll take the beans and toast. If my son can't beat me in a rap battle the second he comes out the womb, mmm, yikes! <laughs> so we're gonna hit it uno reverse. Sorry! Plop your ass back into that cave that you came from, and you're gonna marinate in there for a couple more months, and then we'll try again. Because I need me a rapper, son. Somebody that's gonna go platinum, sell out arenas, worldwide tours, Grammy nominated, Grammy award winning. Somebody that's gonna put me up in a penthouse when I'm 70 years old with a bunch of bad bitches. Well, uh... I'll probably I'll probably still be married to your mother, so we'll put we'll put a hold on the bitches. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna name him Bubbles. Currently looking for some new friends because mine are fake <laughs> and demonic and dirty and rats. This was me a year ago, and not a single one of my friends told me I look like Dobby the house elf. I stepped out the house looking like fucking Rumpelstiltskin. Ah, hello, Diddy headass, and I didn't hear a single fucking peep from y'all. What the fuck, you fake rats! Y'all prayed on my downfall and it fucking worked! Moral of the story is get you some friends that will tell you you look like shit. Because you probably do. <laughs> my grandma just asked me if I'm Team Selena or Team Haley. Sorry! <laughs> what? You're literally a dinosaur! You're like 3,000 years old, that's the last thing you need to be worrying about. Don't you got like wrinkle cream to be applying, you raisin? Then she goes, oh, because I'm Team Haley. Blasphemy, blasphemy, blasphemy. So yeah, I put her in a retirement home. Um, Cause I don't really fuck with that weird shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yo, Selena, got your back twin. You know I'm a slide for you. For lifer, love you. Shit, one thing about me, I ain't gonna nibble. <laughs> I ain't gonna take a little bite. No, sir. I'm a munch. I'm a gobble. <laughs> and swallow. <laughs> I'm gonna eat the whole thing. Lick that plate clean, because that's what I do. I don't leave crumbs. <laughs> Never ever. So. I think I just made the song of the summer. Bombastic side eye. So criminally, criminally, criminally offensive side eye. See you guys in the summer. I'm making this video to apologize to all the wizard or to all the British people that I offended in my last video. Here's three reasons why I love you guys. British people have the best birthday cakes ever. Seriously, like that looks so yummy. I know what you're probably thinking. Peyton, is that a crowbar? No, this is what British people call a toothbrush. Neat. Last but not least, I love British people because they are there for the planet. As you can see here, this is their version of a school bus. Zero emissions. All gas, no brakes. Love British people. 
I've watched way too many Step Up movies to not know how to dance or have any rhythm. I should be able to pop, lock, drop, and then bop on a bitch if I wanted to. But I can't. I mean, I can fumble, rumble, and stumble on a bitch, but that's about it. I can't even dance the wheels on a bus. Some of y'all get under the covers and the foot of the bed starts sounding like a porcupine doing backflips on some. Why are your toenails so thick? Fuck. I'm not always talking about, wait, where's my cuddles? What? Where's the hacksaw to file down your fucking hooves? You gotta be part Velociraptor. You got them Freddy Krueger toenails. Finna slice and dice in the middle of the night. I'm finna wake up with fucking severed Achilles tendon. One, two, three, channel. Okay, hold on, okay. I'm, I'm ready, ready already. already. I'm ready already. One, two, three, towel! Wow. <laughs> Alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's, There's a, a parallel. Dead towel. Okay, okay, okay. okay. One, two, three, blanket! <laughs> okay. One, two, three, cobra! Ah! <laughs> One, two, two three, part! Oh! <laughs> okay. One, two, three, desk! <laughs> One, two, three! Okay. okay. One, two, three, drawer! One, two, two three, shots! Oh. One, One no, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, eraser. <laughs> That's brother, sister. Come here, let me tell you something. More money on the way. <laughs> I never seen that, right? Two dollar bill. More money on the way. <laughs> and that ain't it. Double time. Why did they doubt me? Why did they doubt me? Oh, and you thought it was over, right? More money on the way. <laughs> Yippee! Yahtzee! I just want to let y'all know that <laughs> you can get to this level of success like me as well. You just gotta put your head down. Who am I kidding? You couldn't get this rich if you fucking tried! <laughs> I'm literally so rich! $4.25, I could probably buy three gumballs and... I don't know, but, you know... Well, people always say money doesn't bring you happiness. I'm fucking ecstatic right now. Um, it's only going to go up from here. And trust me, I'm not going to give you guys a single cent, actually. So. Hit me like a ray of sun. Burn it through my darkest nights. So, uh, yeah. Let that sink in. <laughs> I know her name is Bianche. I was actually in the recording studio with her while we were recording Halo. And you know, just off the dome, spitballing. I decided to hit that riff, the infamous, Run it through my darkest nights. I'm not gonna give myself credit for that, but you know, if I didn't hit that, who knows where she would be? Working at Chick-fil-A. I'm working behind the counter at Best Buy. I don't know, but you know, the universe works in mysterious ways. <laughs> Some people walk so others can run. Obviously. In another lifetime, I'll be on that stage. Shining bright like a diamond. I actually also uh, improvised that with Rihanna as well, so. But not everybody can accomplish their dreams, right? Little my talk is nice. It gets better every time. Every time. Elementary school was actually insane. We didn't give a fuck about nothing. We used to be eating boogers like it was damn fruit snacks. We used to come back from recess looking like we worked an 18 hour shift in the fucking coal mines. Back then I would do anything for a fucking snack. I mean, I was so down bad one time. I saw this kid digging in them cheeks for that devil's chocolate. And not even five minutes later, I was sharing a bag of chips with that motherfucker. I, I, I did go cross-eyed for two months after that. So I definitely learned my lesson. Dobby, you different. Dobby, you changed. No. The only thing that changed was my bank account. Uh-huh. Oh, and the name's not Dobby. It's Big D. Uh-huh. 
My girl gave me that. <laughs> Ain't that right, Hermione? Yes, Daddy. Hey, settle down now. It's that muggling shit drives me crazy. But uh, I should probably get back to working on my spells and shit. So, deuces. All right, why don't you win, God? I'm over here, baby. Hello, citizens of the internet. My name is Mugwort. And I am Melgunk. And we are the, the Measly, Measly Brothers. Brothers. Seems as of lately, the female species has been taking a keen interest into our liking. Wouldn't be our first rodeo, but of course. <laughs> you could definitely tell the difference between a normal person and a Measly. Right by looking at them. <laughs> One thing you could say about the Measly Brothers as well, we have more testosterone than a raging male Ryan. Yes, that is true, Measley. Basically, what we wanted to come on here and say is that we are taken. To all the females that come up to me in public, and it is a lot, please stay six feet back. Respect my relationship. My lover is my number one priority in life. And if her heart is hurt, my heart is hurt -er. At heart, we are the Measley brothers. But then again, we are just humans. <laughs> Seriously. Seriously, guys, like, I really love her. I think this is the one. Been on this app for damn near fucking decade, it feels like, and I still can't find an edit of me. Not one single edit. Really. Am I that fucking ugly? Damn! What's a boy gotta do to get an edit made of him? Shake some ass? You know if I had some, I would, but I ain't got shit. It's just bones. You know if I had that dumpy, I'd be generous with it. Be rubbing it all over your screen. Somebody need a fucking back rub or what? What do we? What? I'll do anything. I just want one little beautiful edit of me to make me feel like a princess. I want to feel like a princess. So, please. Hello, citizens of the internet. We've been getting a lot of questions lately regarding how we are able to corral such ravishing women. First things first is your keen and your keen eye for fashion. As you can see here, by my brother, Milgun Kmeesley. Absolutely, I'll take it away from here, brother. This is an outfit I like to call tasteful, yet ravishing, yet dangerous, at the same time. Yep, the triple threat. The tri <laughs> it hits all the three main food courses women just can't resist. All in one meal. Breakfast, dinner, and desserts. As you can see, my sailor, well, he knows what he's doing. He's got me with the pink lapel, triple button all the way down. This is what I like to call the conversation piece. Every good outfit must have one. Well, body by bacon. Who oh, the frick knows what that means? <laughs> I sure don't. <laughs> well, I have quite the taste in my undergarment. And from the buttocks to the ankle, well, it's tailored perfectly. Now, Mugwort, why don't you take us through this one? I'd love to, brother. Thank you, Measley. And we'll start off at the top. The cap. Or shall I say, the crown to the king. It has light fixtures in it. You were out on the town in the night's dark. Well, let's just say I light up the whole place. Not with my hat, but with my heart. And my personality. <laughs> well, with a little bit of a hat. <laughs> and taking us to the midsection. This is one of my favorite t-shirts in my closet. You can see the grease stains pretty much covering the entirety of the shirt. Yes, that just shows that we are out on the town constantly. We are constantly slaying. Wow. Constantly bringing home some of the baddest of the baddest. Right, but in your case, well, you just eat french fries on your fucking neck. <laughs> Down to the bottoms here. These are some of my favorite pants. As you can see, they have some of my favorite colors, red, white, and blue. These are primary colors that will catch any female's attention, as I usually do. Female brains cannot seem to resist the prime colors on you. Yes, that is true. And don't forget the Crocs. These will last you a lifetime. You can wear them in the mud, as we usually do. A square dance in and whoa! Well, we hope some of this info got through your thick skulls and you can finally start to implant a little bit of measly into your every zang. Hopefully, fuck. Because that is the, is the answer to life. A little bit of measly a day? Well, it keeps the doctors away. And it keeps the women at bay. See ya. <laughs> I'm bored. What do you want to do? Maybe we can put on the gloves. Do you like a little spar? Huh? Huh? <laughs> First hot take of 2024, a little nervous, okay. 
how about instead of applying chapstick every five seconds, let's shut the fuck up for once, okay? Because that's probably the reason why your lips are so dry. You talk a lot. You're yapping constantly. My ears hurt and your lips look like fucking accordions because you talk so much, damn it. Sorry. Um, why don't you give your big fat fucking lips a rest, go back to Yapville and take a nap. Mm -hmm. Guys, I think I'm in my princess era. <laughs> for real, for real. Thank you for all the edits. Y'all went ham. Y'all snapped. Y'all went absolutely bonkers, mate. Got me over here kicking my feet and shit. Your little princess made a YouTube video reacting to all the edits. <laughs> Fuck are you doing here still? Go watch, bitch. <laughs> okay, so if I'm playing music in my car and you want to sing along, yet you don't know the lyrics? Hmm? Sorry. What are you doing? <laughs> You're killing the vibe! Yeah! You're killing the vibe! The song came out a decade ago and you still don't know the lyrics? You had your chance! <laughs> Better luck next year! <laughs> You're gonna zip the lip, throw away the key, sit back, relax, and shut the fuck up! <laughs> Cause you're killing the vibe! Mm hmm I will start doing donuts in that motherfucker and I'll kick your ass out halfway through, okay? <laughs> I'm not the hero you all wanted, but I'm the hero you need. This is for everybody that says bad words. Seriously? Stop saying that. Sup? You need to stop saying those words. Sup? Just use better vocabulary. Sup? Santa Claus is always watching, and he is putting you on the naughty list. Sup? Oh shit, Jake's about to fight. <laughs> Yeah, no, I literally sold my microwave to pay for this. And down goes Ben Askren. Holy he shit, say? he got folded like a fucking lawn chair. No. Well, folks, what thanks for tuning blame? in. God. That's going to be it for tonight. Oh, and whoever Stop. gave me their microwave, you're a fucking moron. God. Oh. Hey, baby girl. Hey. So, you don't have to say yes or anything, but I was wondering if you want to go play with my balls. I mean... Go ball. Come, you want to ball up? Onker. I made the ball. Okay, here. That's cool. Hey, are you sure you want to mess with me? Cause my dad's Michael Jordan. Are you for serious? I promise, I never lie. Okay, then prove it. Okay. Holy freaking crap! You are Michael Jordan's daughter. I. Th Come on, baby. Oh my god, babe! I think he's gonna take his first steps. I'll be damned. It's only been three months. Let's go, big head. Come on. Mm -hmm. Come on, make it my mama's got you. Oh, why are you walking like that? Throw it away. Throw the whole thing away. What do you want me to say? He walks like he has two left feet. That's not my son. Look at that slowpoke. He'll never be as fast as a Lamborghini. Yeah, he's probably as slow as a slug. Stop saying that. <gasps> no. Maybe he is a Lamborghini. Oh yeah. Adios, boyos. I got a plane to catch. Wait, I'm sorry. Holy, he's probably faster than a cheetah. What you eating over there? Damn! Oh, shit, those are Frito-Lays, huh? Yeah, try one. Nah, I'm good. I Come on. Come on. One don't hurt, right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let me Go ahead, man. I'm telling you, this shit... <clears throat> Damn, let me get another one. Mm. Mm, so good. Give me another one. Let go to bed. Damn. Come on. Eat one before I feel bad for eating all of them. We really got bitches out here posing like this. Bethany, the last time you brushed your tongue was in 2000 and never. Don't think for a second I won't. Uh, no, put that back in there. Close your mouth. Thank you. There ain't nobody trying to smell the four-course meal of dog food left on your tongue, okay? You're fogging up my fucking lens. Imagine coming out the womb and the first thing you hear is, Oh my God, it's my baby boy, Doug. Oh. Doug? The way I would have launched out of those nurses' hands and slithered my little boneless body back into that cave and went Benjamin Button up in this bitch? You had nearly 500 million different options and you chose Doug. 
Doug. What? Hey, dweeb. Where's my lunch money? Look, bro. You don't want to mess with me. Oh, really? Because last time I remembered, you ordered an Uncle Sam sandwich. <sighs> I warned him. Guardian Angels? Run. Bitches really built like rats. Like this you? And they always be saying shit like Actually, that is not uh politically correct. It's called amphibious, not infamous. <laughs> A lot of people get that mixed up. Hey there everybody. Today I'm gonna be showing you some of my favorite boots. So yeah, let's get right into it. I'm super excited. These are called the Black Mambas. Probably the fastest out of the bunch. One second I'm here, the next second I'm all the way on Jupiter. Up next are the Red Smoke Lumberjacks. I usually wear these when I'm playing with tires and doing manly stuff, so. Last but not least are my Buckskin Cowboy Boots. I only wear these when I'm eating mashed potatoes. <laughs> and I love mashed potatoes. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Oh my god. Yo, do not wake up and scarf down half a bag of salt and vinegar chips. Bitch, I feel like I'm about to shit out a pack of AAA batteries. I ain't had Pop Rocks since the fifth grade. What the fuck is that? 911, what is your emergency? Yeah, uh, the back of my throat sound like the 4th of July and my asshole's hot. I just don't know what to do and I'm getting really scared here. I feel like I'm a blow. I'm a blow. This is literally me if I if somebody were to come up to me and say cottage cheese is better than mashed potato. Sir, can you please put on your seatbelt, please? Because you just bought tickets to the gun show. So, yeah. Ladies, how are you gonna get left on red by a dude named Cooper? Cooper? This your mans? This who you simping over? Girl. Ditch Cooper. Get yourself a real cowboy like me who bake you mud pies and shit. And don't let the boots fool you, bitch. I can get jiggy if you wanna get jiggy. Send this to your friend that's just posted up in a room, 20 hours a day like. Sorry, Mom, I'm not going to be able to make it to the kitchen tonight for dinner. Me and the boys got an ender dragon to slay for the 80th time this week. <laughs> I guess you could say I'm, uh, built different. <laughs> oh, you built like a neck pillow. I've seen camels with straighter backs than you, bitch. My name's Hillbilly Buck, and you're watching Hillbilly Buck TV. On today's episode, we're going to be catching squirrels with my bare hands. Come on, let's go. We're getting right into the action, folks. I've tracked myself a squirrel into this brush back here, and I'm about to catch that son of a bitch with my bare hands. How'd you get over here? Damn it! Some bitch got away. Come on, let's go. We're tracking that bitch now. Come on. <laughs> Fuck me. Could have sworn I had that son of a bitch in my hands, boys and girls. I'm sorry I couldn't catch a squirrel for you today, but be sure to tune in to Hillbilly Buck TV next week, where me and my sister will go down to Florida. To catch ourselves some gators. Hey, Billy Buck out. Hey, Michael Jordan's daughter, please stop talking trash about me because it hurts my heart and my bones. You always say, oh, Peyton's not fast. Then why can I do this? So stop saying that. Also, don't stay in bad at shooting because my great grandpa taught me. He's in a wheelchair now. So. This is for you, Grandpa. Bitch. Little kids give no fucks. They will literally take a fat ass shit in their pants right in front of you and stare you down the whole time. On some. Why? Acting challenge. You're the blue line. Scram! Get out of here! Does that answer your question? <laughs> Sorry, sweet chicks. I only marry werewolf chicks, and you're not even... <sighs> Wait, you're...
Oh, you're one bad dog. <laughs> Acting challenge. You're the blue line. Stop saying that. <sighs> I'm not a loser. I'm a savage. <sighs> you asked for it. Go Cougars! <laughs> I tried warning you. It's okay, Buttercup. It's okay. Let's go back to my place. We can eat Hot Pockets and play Fortnite. <laughs> I'm not the best. I'm the savage. Hey, excuse me, can you watch my kid while I go to the bathroom real quick? Oh. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm awesome. I'll be right back. My name's- How you gonna get left on red by a dude with size 9 shoes? That boy built like a dart. Like- This your mans? This the one that be leaving you on red? Mr. Gru shoes? Ditch Mr. Puppy Paws. It's time for you to get a real stallion like me. Over here rocking them size 23 hooves, bitch. You ain't never seen speed like this. So are we just not gonna talk about how Lunchables are actually fucking dookie? Bitches used to roll up with a rich cracker, cold tomato sauce, and some bunion flakes and call it a pizza. Okay, Papa John's! Fuck out of my face! Don't even get me started on these soggy ass nuggets! Here comes lunchtime, these bitches ain't even thought out yet! Had to throw a couple under my armpit just to warm it up! I can't even clear my throat in public anymore! I hit a little... <clears throat> bitches like... No! Oh, he got the Rona! What are you doing? Oh, he hacking up a lung! He probably got the Black Plague! Bitch, you ain't even wearing a mask. Somebody get rid of him, I'm already starting to lose my vision. Who knows, this boy probably got the Benjamin Button disease too! Bitch, Security? that's not even contagious! Security? Bitch. I feel like my teachers just wanted to see me get my ass kicked. They like- Hey! Just because he hit you first doesn't mean you can hit him back. Use your words next time. You're a big boy. Right. Hey, sorry to bother you, but could you like please stop curb stomping the fuck out of my face, please? Um, it really hurts my heart and my bones, and that's not good. So if you could just be a little bit nicer, that'd be great. Okay. Bye. Started when we younger, you were mine. My boo, come on. Had to do it to him, so. If you want a bad girl sing for Valentine's Day, just say this to Bay. Are you going? Yes. Hi, sugar. Are you here for your appointment with the love doctor? Because you're gonna get shot today. You're gonna get a shot today. A love shot, that is. So sit down, relax, and enjoy the ride because Dr. Love has got everything under control. <laughs> <laughs> Bitches start wearing a mask and think they ain't gotta brush their teeth. <laughs> Sorry. Oh? Did you fall? Oh, so that's just your fucking breath, isn't it? <laughs> Crikey's. You smell like a donkey's arse after you had the bowl of fucking chili. Oh, that's it. I'm angry, and you just opened up a can of that one, two, willy whammy. This is what you get for not brushing your fucking teeth. Fellas, here's how to seduce a lady in three simple steps. Step one, women love booty just as much as we do, so I want you to shake it till she can't take it. Hey, that thing sang it. Body, Number two. Ladies love it when you can speak a little Spanish. Hi, sugar. Quiero comerme los dedos de los pies. That's I want to eat your toes in English. Number three. Ladies love an alpha, so I want you to show her who the big dog is and give her your biggest bark. Here's mine. Is somebody sad their boyfriend cheated on them? 
Well, you should have saw it coming when you found out he used his axe body wash six in one. That boy don't give a fuck. He over here using this shit to brush his teeth and wash his car. He don't care about you. He don't even care about himself.